Hi there folks, you're talking the story. After a weekend with four new cases of COVID-19, the province reported no new cases of the virus today. Currently one person is in hospital and there are 10 active cases. So far 289 people have recovered from the virus, 56,869 people have been tested. In other news, on Friday evening there was a single vehicle ATV accident on the Avondale Access Road. RCMP say that the man, a 25-year-old who was wearing a helmet, was thrown from the ATV and died at the scene. Police say alcohol was a factor in the collision. And finally, UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson is self-isolating after a meeting at 10 Downing Street that featured an MP who later tested positive for COVID-19. Six MPs and two political aides have also entered a period of self-isolation. Johnson was admitted to the ICU unit seven months ago when he had COVID-19. Your weather forecast is coming up right after this. We were getting married in the most beautiful rural setting. My mom got sick and couldn't be with us for our big day. I was heartbroken. Thankfully, we discovered ExploreNet. They responded right away and connected us to high-speed internet. Our big day was incredible because it felt like mom was there. ExploreNet. Connect to what matters. As we take a look at your weather forecast, it will be anything but calm and tranquil. There are several weather alerts in effect. There is a uh, wind warning in effect for uh, the Avalon, uh, the Bonavista Peninsula, also for uh, the south and the west coast. The Red House wind warning in Channel Port of Bass and vicinity. Winds tonight may gust to 120 before diminishing tomorrow. And uh, there is a snowfall warning in effect for uh, Red Bay to Lance of Clare. Overnight tonight, we are looking at rain right across the board. St. John's will pick up about 10 to 15 millimeters. We could see winds gusting at times to 100 kilometers per hour and a low of 5. Uh, Gander tonight, a low of 2, 5 to 10 millimeters of rain, winds gusting to 90. And a similar story in Corner Brook as well. As we move into the forecast for tomorrow, it is going to be fairly unsettled for the province. We are looking at a mix of sun and cloud for all areas. But there is a chance of seeing uh, either some showers or some flurries or rain showers, depending on where you are for the island portion of the province. Eight expected in St. John's, getting up to six in Gander, three in Corner Brook. And then as we move into Labrador, sun and cloud expected for Happy Valley, Goose Bay, and for Nain, and a chance of flurries in Labrador City. As we take a look at your extended forecast, it is going to be pretty unsettled this week. St. John's getting up to a high of eight tomorrow, and uh, there is a chance of showers. And for Wednesday, a chance of flurries or rain showers. Thursday, we do cool down with a chance of flurries. Friday and Saturday, a mix of sun and cloud with highs around plus five. And then as we head into Gander, we are looking at uh, a chance of showers and six for your Tuesday. Sun and cloud for Wednesday. Thursday and Friday, there is a chance that we could see some flurries. Saturday, we are looking at sun and cloud with a chance of some showers. And then finally, in Corner Brook, sun and cloud with a chance of flurries or rain showers for your Tuesday. And then for Wednesday, Thursday, and for Friday, we are looking at a chance of flurries, and we round out your five day with a chance of flurries or rain showers. That's your news and your forecast, and now you can check out newfoundnews.ca for more.